Alan Partridge is at Marple for today's horse races. I wonder what he's doing at the moment. Alan? Hi, Chris. I'm Alan Partridge. Horses. Love more hate them from Mr Ed to Silver. That's the Lone Ranger's horse. They're all here mingling with officials. Don't do that, please. It's the 6.13 Queen Henry Stakes, which is generally regarded as the litmus test for Derby form. Jockey folklore says that uh, if you cock up the Queen Henry, you might as well ride the Derby on a cow, which, of course, be a complete waste of time. Let's uh, have a look at the betting. The going today, of course, caused moist to tricky. The betting diabetic Charlie at three to one favourite, who headed sex beast at four to one, and at twenty to one, Mrs. Boothroyd's holiday dancer. All the rest, fifty to one bar. That's all for uh, now. Join us later for the race. Back to you, Chris, in the studio. Alan, have you got a tip for us? Uh, I was. I did have a tip, but. Uh, I was going to tip New Year's lad, but his uh, horse box was hit by a Volvo on the M3. Um, terrible mess. Apparently he's, uh, he's dead. So, bad luck there. Back to you, Chris. Stop it. That's an amazing coincidence, Alan, because last week, Kalatali's sisters, you were involved in a car crash in which you were the only survivor. Only because you landed in somebody's stomach. Hello again. The 6.30 delayed due to a collapsed paddock. They're just sorting that out. Men and women here... Wandering around like ants on an anthill. Good to see Platitude Queen, a renowned horse, well known for its sense of humour. Look at that wiggle. Marvellous. I what that is. Two to look out for. Number one there, Zainab Adawi's 20 Hotels. And uh, number three, two-headed sex beast. It's great to see the death catered for by these... Uh, Real characters in uh, anoraks. Couple of youngsters there fooling around. Let's hope that that uh, tomfoolery doesn't escalate into blind, ugly violence, which, let's face it, none of us want to see. Two fat ladies, 88. Old bingo expression there. Although these ladies, I'm very sure, are uh, not the kind of ladies who you'd find at uh, the bingo hall. They're all together a better class of fat lady. Look at that. Lovely girl there, chomping on a sandwich. Oh. That's all that is. Hope it's, uh, <laughs> hope it's not a dead horse. They're not going to fit it in the back of uh, a Volvo 340. Actually, I hope it isn't a dead horse. Sorry. But first, Alan Partridge for the delayed 6.30 at Marple. Alan, either you've just had a fight with a fire engine or it's raining its arse off out there. Hi, Chris. No racing as of yet. As you can see, one or two problems with the weather. It's uh, really quite wet here. really is quite wet. It was horrible. Really awful. Back to you in the studio. Back to today's races. Alan Partridge is at the... Um, oh, excuse me. Better let him lie in it. Let him lie in it. I'm Alan Partridge here at Marple with me. Um, just a quick look at the betting. Onion Terror, two to one favourite, seven to four, massive bereavement, and 100 to 30. Trust me, I'm a stomach. All the rest, three to one bar. The 6:30 has a 50-minute delay due to a uh, fist fight near the paddocks between two officials. One of them now hospitalised. But uh, I'm pleased to say I have with me the winner of the last race. Come here, come here, Mickey Doolan. Hello, how are you? I'm very well. Are you now? Now, how do you feel about uh, the race there? You, you, you won that race, the last race. How do you feel about that? Well, very pleased to have won the race. It was a hard yeah. race, won it by a nose at the end, you know, so uh, it's, and, it's uh, what, and your mum and dad must be pleased. And what do they think of you doing this? Shouldn't you be at school? Do they not think you're sort of missing out on schoolwork? Well, I think I'll be a little bit old for that now. I'm 33 years of age, what? you know. That's right, I'm 33 years You're 33? That's right, now. But I thought you... I mean, you look about 14. Well, I'll take that as a compliment, you know. Are you really 33 years 33 old? 33 years of age, that's why. My God! Well, wait, wait, all the others, are they, like, are they, th are they sort of 30... I mean, they're not children? Well, age varies from about, you know, 18 to 42, or maybe a bit older. But you're so that. small! Well, that's the idea, you know. I mean, if I was any bigger, if it was your size, then I wouldn't have won a race today. Right, that's why you never see people like Brian Blessed riding <laughs> horses. No, it makes sense. Right, well, thanks very much for talking to us, Mickey Doolan. Mickey Doolan here at uh, Marple. Ah, raining.